Hello everybody, welcome to another test here. Now today as you can see we're looking at the Windows 8 customer preview. Now you can get it free at www.microsoft.com from their authorized developers. Now this is a customer preview, it's not the final version of Windows 8 so it still probably has some errors but what I've been looking at it seems that Windows 8 is more well equipped to deal with threats than probably Windows 7. So let's just take a look at their features here. Now I'm having still having some problems here with their interface but just try to take a look here. This is what the interface looks like, Windows 8, I'll make a different video on this. Uh, right now I guess let's just uh, get to the control panel. Actually I'm having, uh, kind of having some problems with their interface here, because I'm not that experienced with Windows. Uh, Eight. So okay, so here we are finally. As you can see, the Windows 8 interface is kind of a pain to operate. Uh, this new start menu can be annoying sometimes. It's good for tablets, but if you're looking at desktop systems, then this might be a problem. Anyway. Uh, I've learned to get my way around somewhat, but it's still not that good. Now it still has the Windows firewall that powered Windows 7 security and we have Windows updates. Something more important is the Windows Defender. Okay, now Windows Defender earlier used to just scan for some spyware and stuff. Now this Windows Defender is a full featured security um, um, tool. Now it has virus and spyware definitions and it's pretty well equipped to deal with threats. Now this basically is kind of a merging of the security, you know, uh, the security essentials and Windows Defender. As you can see, even this one is connected to their cloud and this kind of protects you from about everything. So this is the interface. So let's just take a look at their level of security here. Let's just go to Google and let's just try clean the Max. And let's see if uh, the combination of all these features actually protects us. Now the Internet Explorer also has some features like uh, as you can see security is set to medium high and I have enabled the you know the download protection whatever they call it uh, the, yeah the smart screen filter so called so let's see if that protects us against these threats so let's start from here there you go first one was blocked by the smart screen filter Okay, let's try the second one. There you go. This one was also blocked by the smart screen filter. Third one has a much lower detection rate, but there you go. It's blocked by Internet Explorer. Okay, let's try to open this. There you go, Windows Smart Screen Filter prevented something from running. So it does look like Windows has worked a lot on its security because it's uh, basically blocking a lot of stuff here. Okay, now this one is dead.
Okay, finally uh, we got one through and that turned out to be a raw file. So you can't exactly blame Windows there. See if this one gets through. There you go, again smart screen filter blocked this. So as you can see we're blocking a lot of stuff with the help of Windows Smart Screen Filter and Windows Defender here. There you go, this one was detected by Windows Defender and it's not going to be let through. There you go, it's removing, there you go, it's uh, removed this virus. Let's try this one. This has got an extremely low detection rate. It might even be a false positive, so I don't think there's much of point trying this. There you go, just for even the best antivirus won't get this, so there's not much of a point trying that one. Let's try something that is confirmed malware. That one's not going to run. But there you go, it's uh, blocked. So, I mean, as you can see, almost everything that we tried was successfully blocked by Windows, which is a huge achievement because Windows has always been having the problem of security here and there, and you always needed an extra application. And there you go, this was a backdoor trying to drop some file, and Windows Defender took care of it. So it looks like the new Windows 8 is amazing, at least when it comes to security. I know a lot of users don't like the interface, even I don't. But we have to admit that their security is just awesome. And this is a lot better than what they had in Windows 7, because you basically would certainly have got infected by now if you were using Windows 7. But this one is just this Windows Defender and the Smart Screen Filter are just doing awesome. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this review. So Windows 8 certainly goes one step forward at least when it comes to security. So that's it for this review. Have a good day.